All right, so this is Big Mac. I would like to share with you guys my long distance Raspberry Pi repeater setup. I have a Raspberry Pi with Kali Linux installed. Uh, this thing is in my attic space. Uh, so the Raspberry Pi, all my machines are connected over Wi-Fi through this Cisco router. It's an E1200. It supports wireless N and it is currently plugged into the Ethernet port of the Raspberry Pi. All clients will receive a IP address from the Raspberry Pi as it is running DNS mask. And then your out interface would be the alpha card, the NHA model that also supports wireless N. So uh, this alpha card is, is uh, also uh, the antenna being used would be this 2.4 gigahertz 16 dbi backfire parabolic dish antenna it has this metal ring which is designed to help block out interferences so this thing is very directional so again the raspberry pi uh, this cisco router has ddwrt installed for better uh, configuration uh, configurations uh, the out interface so let's run a speed test so my laptop here is connected to the router which is then uh, acting as a repeater through the Raspberry Pi and alpha card so these speeds are are pretty good in my opinion for the amount of distance of travel here is is quite a bit I, I could show you on a Google map but you know I'd like to keep my my address private but uh, I can play online games at high speed, you know, diff pretty pretty intense games, uh, Counter Strike, uh, a few others. So I'm not all that satisfied here with the way they report uh, report the uh, download speeds. I feel that it may be a little inaccurate. So again, from the laptop here, I'm gonna perform another download test. The same link uh, with I'm using wget and you have to supply a user agent and then I'm not gonna download anything it's just gonna be removed here so I see uh, it you know it's definitely a little spiky right here I have a speedometer which is monitoring the Raspberry Pi's alpha card interface with the input and output uh, statistics here so it took about 21 seconds for my laptop to download 500, I'm sorry, 5,000 megabytes of data through this test my net uh, tool here, online tool. So right here I'm logged into the Kali Raspberry Pi and we're going to perform that same download and see what we get here. <clears throat> So, depending on the conditions, the weather conditions, um, you know, I'll, I'll see, you'll see here previously I got six seconds. This time around I got nine seconds. The conditions, you know, what kind of interferences are in the air, microwave ovens, there's a lot going on here. The longer distance of travel between your access points and your, your, uh, your alpha card, you know, the more distance involved, the more. Uh, you know sensitive the connection is to interference so what you see here is definitely what I you know I, I use IP tables uh, I'll show you here my RC startup file my, my uh, startup config that I've been I'm trying to improve things what I did here is disabled IP version 6 um, I'm using IP tables to make the alpha card a out interface and then I'm using uh, eth0 as the in interface we've enabled IP version 4 IP forwarding and we've configured the DNS mask and we've started it up and then we've launched WPA supplicant with the NL80211 driver so if you guys have any advice on how I can improve these throughput speeds, uh, you know, definitely, uh, you know, running out of ideas.
better hardware. Probably replacing the Raspberry Pi with something a little more, you know, powerful. So here's a, a nice little tool, uh, my trace route. It displays so from the uh, Raspberry Pi Kali machine again. I'm pinging the router, which is my father's router, from a long distance, and I'm not seeing any packet loss. So I don't believe that that is the issue. I'm seeing decent pings. It shows your average, your best, your worst, and uh, you know it, it is a pretty stable connection. If I was to do the same thing from my laptop, you would see that it's hopping through my Raspberry Pi and off to the uh, my father's router. So you'll see the pings are still pretty consistent, uh, not terrible. Uh, if, again, if you guys have any ideas, uh, please share.